Ah, uh, yes. Linus Tech Tips. Here's some I watched a lot. Linus Tech Tips slammed. Follow tech YouTuber for inaccuracy. Alleged. It's not alleged. It's true. If you watch the videos, it's just it's true. Inaccuracy. Bad ethical practices. Has been under fire by Games Night. It's um, published inaccurate results. They released a 44-minute video. I watched the video. But it discussed CPU, motherboard, graphics card, and showing that they're not, they are not accurate. They, they had, what, a, a 3060 being close to a 30, uh, 90 and a 3090 being, uh, 4090 being 300% better than a 3090, which is not true. It's, it's, I think it's closer to 75, 72%. But anyway, the, the point is, if they did accurate testing and didn't release videos every day, this wouldn't be a problem. And I am just I'm not really a fan of Linus as much anymore. I, I, I quit watching him a while ago and then started back up recently and then I hear this and I'm thinking, what? And not only that, they're getting a new CEO and... Um, well, we have a lot more to talk about. So Linus defends unprofessional uh, Billet Labs review amid a controversy. So we're going to continue here. Uh, YouTube's famous tech channel, Linus Tech Tips. I found this as, okay, yeah. Linus is one of the, uh, okay. It's 15 million. They're just saying what it is. Okay. Uh, hot waters because they're 3090 Ti block. The controversy tip fellow YouTuber Games Nexus to make explosive video landing that bill labs mock review okay gives bill labs a bad review bill labs is a newly founded computer hardware company sent sent linus tape to 39 feet in the water block linus gave the product review thought it was hard one fan took to it twitter called yet unprofessional ltt creator to make it work on a 4090 graphics card when it was work post to work on a 3090 ti this is absolutely unprofessional when you're when it says it's supposed to work on one thing and you try to make it work for the other what do you expect is going to happen not only was the product misrepresented by ltt it was also auctioned off at the expo and given despite bill billet's request to return the cooler to them this was naturally yeah they they said they went to the expo sold it off and they actually wanted it back they stated that LCT, the cooler might fit in the 49, but we didn't have a 4090 to try it. So they they literally told Linus, hey, it might work, right? But we don't have time to say if it does or not. And Linus and I left him a bad review for not doing it in time. Like, that's not that they're not being professional. They literally, it's a new product. They didn't have time to work on it. This is just crazy. This really... This makes me just really upset with with Linus here because they're they're faking how nice he is in their videos. He's I don't think he's really a nice guy, right? I don't think he's as as he is presented to be. Anyway, he stated that he auctioned it for charity. Uh, noted that the monoblock. Uh, yeah, he auctioned it for charity. Yeah, you still got rid of it. And who's charity? Are you your best charity? Anyway, clearly aside, Sebastian said, I wanted to evaluate a product and a product, if it can manage to compete with temperatures in the highest cool blocks on the planet, still not make sense to buy. From some point, retesting and finding out that yes, did in fact make no difference. Didn't matter. You didn't, you didn't do it for, you did it with the 4090 instead of a, what it was meant to be used for. So your response is invalid. Anyway, we have one more thing. And yes, it's coming from, do you know your meme? Anyway, um, this is the best way to get through the whole thing. Gamers Nexus versus Linus Tech Tips refers to, okay. Uh, yep. Crunches, partnerships, wrong equipment. And making memes out of the drama. Well, I love memes, and I want to sit through. But first, I want to go through the background. Uh, 
Yep, they have two million presented. Reportedly face time crunch. Terrible. Have seen discuss interviews with said employees. Such deadlines. They make a video every day, which is terrible. When it's negatively reviewed a mouse. Ev- yeah, and there was a piece of tape covering the sensor. Are you kidding me? How do you review a mouse? Look, look, I have a mouse right here. It's an Alienware mouse, right? I use it. You didn't... Of course it wouldn't work right if you have tape on it. Oh, my goodness. Anyway. Major concern is that the product prototype built labs... Once again, we just went over the built labs, so I won't go over it here. A Linus text responds to Gamer Nexus in a thread. And they're quickly pitchforks raised over this. I'm going to go ahead and read this here. Let's make it a little bigger. Oh, I can't make it bigger. I can't make it bigger. Yeah, I can. Here we are. Um, to my and my CEO team, realistically, we have an important diligence. Okay. Now, in the community, I can say we always... Okay, we're an inflection. It was sloppy. Are you kidding me? GPU views are getting inc- really incredible given the lemon time. You don't have limited time. You can delay a video. You don't have to make a YouTube video every day. Delay it. Make sure it's right. Give them more time. You don't need to make a video every day. Adam and I were talking about today, and he advocated retesting it regardless of how non-viable the product was. Good. Do that. Either way, I'm sorry for the community's priorities. Here's his fake nicest. He's he is being he is not being accurately nice. I think Linus is probably really pissed right now, and he's being told by some kind of um, fluffer, "Hey, you got to release a statement." That's what I hear. And anyway, we can test that this post with it being a mistake, a bad one. Let if anyone is actually wants to know what happened. I hope so. okay. So let's go down. Reportedly, compensate Billet for auctioning off the one of the kind prototype reportedly. Good. I, I didn't see that last time, but if that actually happened, good. Games and response to Linus Forms on August 15th. Yep. Uh, being uploaded. This uh, Linus response disappointing and noted that he is unapologetic for making, pointed out in Game and He very is. It's true. Moreover, Burke noted that the timeline of events transpired in the initiative has reached... Okay, Burke uncovered Linus only reimbursed the company for the stolen prototype after the video was posted and didn't didn't give him any more money uh, for compensation. So, he only gave them money so he could say in the post that they he compensated them. How scummy, dude. How scummy. Uh, expressing their gratitude and support in the PC community. Let's see what this is. You, you the PC community, are amazing. We like your support. Okay. Steve, a game is public, shown his integrity uh, regarding LTT. We're simply going to state relevant facts. On ten, uh, sold at an auction. There was no apology. No apology. You didn't. You didn't have the balls to say sorry. For selling your prototype. Is planned. Okay. If they plan to reimburse us. Reply. No offer of payment until two hours after Gamers Nexus video went live. Someone had to. Oh my goodness. This this is so bad. Another YouTuber had to call them out. So they would pay the company. Are you kidding me? About the future. Okay. None of the rest is important. Online reactions. As a controversy in LTT, uh, you can have memes. But yeah, look at me. I am the tech tips man now. Why everyone... <laughs> These are funny. Um, and here's some more. Linus tech tips. Dear value subscribers... Okay. <laughs> I, I don't curse on the channel, but this is also funny. You can read it here. And then theft accidental auction. Yeah, that's that's what they're calling a accidental auction. It's theft. Oh, what do you boot? All right. Well, I wanted to cover this controversy here in this video. And um, 
Let me know your thoughts in the comments. If you think Linus Tech Tips is actually a terrible company, or I said Linus Media Group is actually a terrible company, or, or these are honest mistakes. I'm thinking these are fake niceties. They're not actually as lenient on how they go about their stuff. I don't know if Linus wasn't involved with the auction or didn't know he wasn't allowed to sell it. And it doesn't matter if it's for charity. If they said don't sell it, it doesn't belong to you. Well, then it doesn't belong to you. Don't sell it. <laughs> it doesn't matter if you got the money or not. They didn't reimburse them until they got called out, which just not, just that's just terrible. Like who does? Come on. Um, but yeah, so that's the video. I want to thank you all for watching. And if you like these uh, videos about other YouTubers, let me know. Uh, also in the comments because I will I love just roasting other people okay it's one of my favorite things to do is to look at other people and see if they're bad or not that's why they call me the dawn <laughs> it's uh, it's because I really don't care anyway uh, yeah thanks so I'm Dawn Solomon the dawn of everything and have a good one